Jackson, Mississippi. You know, there were a few things that I liked about the town. This open mic was not one of them, sadly. In fact, I'm rating this as the second worst open mic that I went to um, on uh, my little road trip. <laughs> and, uh, venue was okay, but uh, wow. All right, let's, uh, let's look at the venue. This is the inside of the place. And it's uh, kind of cool. Got two, two levels, although no, it's just one level. One level and an outdoors. And uh, yeah, two rooms. This is the stage right here. Small, dark, kind of relaxing. I'm uh, sitting here talking to the bartenders and this neat guy named Trey who just relocated here from Nashville. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, the uh, sign up, I guess, can happen as early as four in the afternoon um, and they apparently will take phone calls for you to do that the event itself starts at nine o'clock and it looks like it runs till um, well uh, after 12 they've got like they do kind of a contest here which is funny since I've never done anything like that but, uh, um, since I'm not really competing. So that was, you know, the venue was all right. Um, then I, you know, talked to the host, and uh, here's his little statement. And then everything. Finian's Pub, uh, Jackson, Mississippi. I've hosted this open mic night for the last two years. My brother and one of my good friends, Joe Carroll, hosted it for years before that. But it's been voted best open mic night in Jackson for like 15 years running. And we've been a part of it for the last five years and been playing at it the whole 15. So it's a culmination of all of us doing what we can to keep local music local and trying to take it to the masses so you know, right, cool. i hope y'all enjoy it we'll, we'll get back and see how it goes <laughs> right, thank you this is an example of uh of the host playing his stuff take the time to take your I'm just going to jump right to it, because I don't have a whole lot positive to say about this. Um, the venue, the venue was all right, actually. I kind of liked the place during the day. I mean, it was okay. It seemed to be like a uh, an evening. It kind of, you know, seemed like it was just a place for, like, collegiate um, jocks and their and significant others to come and go, woo, you know, and I guess for that, you know, as a place for college kids or post-college kids to get drunk and go, woo, um, it's okay. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, um, uh, during the day I had a great time there. I thought it was a nice place. Um, the host, the host, um, you know, I wanted to like him and I think his heart was in the right place, but, um, aside from, you know, really being a self-promoter, and really being a promoter of the open mic, when push came to shove and the actual open mic was going on, the guy just barely moderated anything, and he was just kind of jumping all over the place, going outside. I mean, he just kind of <laughs> just kind of abandoned ship. Um, the sound system was, um, you know, it was there. It wasn't terrible. Um, other performers, well, they were nice. Um, the ones that were there, there were very few. And they had this, like, contest thing going on, too. Um, the audience, you know, it's probably one of the worst audiences that I've encountered because they just didn't care. 
Um, in fact, it was all just blah, blah, blah. There was a kid that went on before me, real nice guy, played a bunch of covers. Um, he was really talented, you know, and I go on. Um, yeah, people were just kind of yak, yak, yak until this guy came in and did some spectacularly bad hip hop. And then all the college kids are like, yeah, dude. <laughs> so, you know, it's definitely, it seems like a, uh, uh, 20, 30 something crowd and, um, uh, really into just getting their party on. So, uh, that seems to be the extent of it. Would I play there again? Oh God, no, no. I, I would almost rather have rats gnaw upon my eyeballs than uh, play that open mic again. It was a distinctly painful experience. And, um, yeah, you know, I guess the, the open mic in Jackson, Mississippi. So, which says something, I guess. Um, so, yeah, uh, real brief review, not a good one. Uh, big thumbs down, frankly. I, uh, I just thought... Um, I thought it could have been done so much better, but it was just like this pell-mell, disorganized, obnoxious kind of hoo-hoo, hee-haw, you know, thing. So there it is. All right. Um, better, <laughs> better times to come.